Let's explore how to compare whole numbers. Would you prefer $376,899 or $367,988? If you can compare numbers, this choice would be easy for you. We compare numbers using greater than, less than, and equal to. When showing a comparison, it can be hard to remember which way to point the greater than and less than symbols. Perhaps a hungry alligator trick will help you to remember. Take a look. Let's start with easy numbers. Say the hungry alligator, a very hungry alligator who loves bananas, can only have one pile of bananas. Which pile would he take? 34 bananas or 27 bananas? Obviously, 34 is greater than 27, so he would choose the pile with 34. The alligator mouth will always be open toward the greatest number of bananas. When 34 is written first, the mouth is open this way. Of course, you don't need to draw the mouth so it would look like this. And read 34 bananas is greater than 27 bananas. If 27 was written first, the mouth would be facing the other way. In your work, it would look like this. And read 27 is less than 34. Thinking of a hungry alligator will help you to put your greater than and less than symbols facing the right way. When comparing larger numbers, think of place value. Remember, places that are farther to the left are larger or greater, and places that are farther to the right are smaller or less. Let's see how we can apply place value to rules for comparing numbers. We have two basic rules for comparing whole numbers, and whole numbers are numbers without a decimal. Rule number one. If one number has more digits than another number, it is always larger. Rule number two. With numbers that have the same number of digits, always compare using the largest place value that is different. Let's take a closer look at the first rule. Here are two whole numbers. Count the number of digits in each number. The first number has six digits. The second number has seven digits. Therefore, the first number is less than the second number. The first number has digits to the hundred thousands place, but the second number goes all the way to millions. The alligator's mouth will be open toward the second number, showing that 978,899 is less than 1,234,321. And in your work, it would look like this. Sometimes, though, numbers have the same amount of digits. For these numbers, we use the second rule. With numbers that have the same number of digits, always compare using the largest place value that is different. Let's take a look at an example. Compare 78,989 with 78,899. Both of these numbers have five digits. Comparing numbers is easier when the second number is written under the first. When we write one number under the other, we carefully line up the digits with the ones under the ones, the tens under the tens, and so on. And we always compare starting with the largest place value. The largest place in these numbers is the ten thousands, so we'll start there. Both numbers have seven ten thousands. Now we'll look at the next place. Both have eight thousands. Let's look at the next place. The first number has nine hundreds. The second number has only eight hundreds. This is the largest place value that is different, so we know that the first number is greater than the second number. We don't even need to look at the remaining digits, as tens and ones are smaller than hundreds. Since the first number is greater, the alligator mouth will be facing the first number. And we read this, that 78,989 is greater than 78,899. And in your work, you don't have to draw an alligator mouth. You can just draw it like this. Let's try one last pair of numbers. First, we need to figure out which rule applies. Rule number one. If one number has more digits than another, it is always larger. Well, the blue number has seven digits, and the red number has seven digits. So rule number one doesn't apply. So we go to rule number two. With numbers that have the same number of digits, always compare using the largest place value that is different. To do this, we can line them up one underneath the other and start with the largest place value. Both numbers have six millions. Both numbers have 200,000. Both have three ten thousands. 
Both have four ten thousands. Both have three hundreds. Both have four tens. Both have five ones. Sometimes numbers are not greater than or less than one another. Our poor alligator will be confused. Instead of a greater than or less than sign, this example is equal. Comparing numbers is easy if you remember the rules. 